And they set up some um, proprietary instruments that yeah, right. on Earth we didn't even think of. Um, and uh, made me laugh. I like that. I love it. She's like, I want to do something for your music stuff. And I was just like, draw a picture of uh, me with a, a ridiculous size forehead. <laughs> My name is Brian Dickens, and you're listening to WXPL 91.3, Bridgeburg State University Radio. Get some songs. I'll All set right. to start. All right. <laughs> Inflation, righteous indignation Donna to my friends and their parents All the same Their fickle focus, trusty and non-lazy Foregone conclusions of the day to day No schemas guiding their complexions No randomness and isolations But I got paper, ink, and patience Proper time to find the stuff Very, very much. I'm gonna play a song called Life in the Hands from that album. Put my life in the hands of some doctor out in Concord and then a carriage as my parents have consciously assigned her to a wood. Station wagon with a bagel dent in the bumper That my dad put there once he got the call That nine months wasn't ever gonna come after a while That I was chewing in the pot and now no, no one had a say in the matter But sometimes even still I wish they'd I got killed By my prenatal anxieties to enter this stupid world so my exhausted show songs they might end before they began. But 
Some lady named Edie drove my boss to school, made it look real easy to hack the toxic bad that we were both nearing. Came to know the terror that I learned to wait in that hurt and coercion that I let her grade in. But by the end of the day, Edie and I'd be hanging, blasting WAAF and putting our speakers to the test and how. All the others they would protest to request a new soundtrack for the ride. She would turn that big mirror, look them straight in the eyes, and say, Don't ask again to change it to 94.5. My life in the hands of one Walmart clerk. She sold me my first ACDC record. Who knew the trouble I'd get into for just ten dollars? I got the hang of the blues through a Texas flood. I came to stand the weather by Stevie Ray Sun. I stood atop the stack of my mom's vinyls to get taller. But I keep tuning out my dad when he asks, Man, what's your backup plan? Once your stage lights dim, all your flyers rip your turn 36. You're living out of a bag, and I'm working on my answers. But until then, I hope he takes my songs. And even when they're sad, which is a whole lot. That was life in the hands. That's 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 what I say instead of giving a biography anytime I play. I just play that one. <laughs> yeah, that's a uh, that song is a lot more uh, personal it seems than a lot of your other stuff. Uh, yeah, sure. Personal yeah. of most personal of a lot of them. Yeah. 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 The the new record seems to have a lot a lot of songs that are a little bit more on the introspective side, mm -hmm. where a lot of your previous stuff has been more political or you know social. Yeah. Yeah. Um, personal wise, well, the album's called Posterity Measures, and Posterity Measures is uh, well, it's a joke on austerity measures, which is sort of a nod to the political leanings of the record. Um, but Posterity Measures, it's all about uh, memory. It's all about keeping track of things, and so the best way I learned how to do it, um, not only writing, which I do a lot on the side, uh, um, I write a lot of songs and a whole mm. ton of them never make it to cd and i think that's really an important part of songwriting is um making bad art <laughs> making a lot of it yeah <laughs> releasing some of it no um <laughs> but uh getting all of it out there and picking the trimmings and putting them on the record because mm. that's all anybody ever does yeah no one writes 10 great songs for a 10 song album right they write like 20. It's with writing. I make a lot of bad writing. You know. When you get into infrastructure, like important stuff, like bridges mm. and stuff like that, there's a little less room for bad yeah. bridges. But <laughs> but, yeah. Good lesson for architects. Design 10 bad bridges in the real world. <laughs> See which one falls over. All right. I'm going to play a song called Big Fish. And um, when, I, when I play this song, I find myself saying, um, well, I wrote this song five years ago. And then one day I said, wait a minute, no, I wrote the song six years ago. And I actually wrote the song like seven years ago. <laughs> and I wrote it on a, uh, on a commuter rail trip, going to Boston, thinking about the travels that I have in my tiny little town. And how, this is a song about how easy it is to be a big fish when your little town is just a little puddle. <laughs> I 
I spent a whole night driving drunk on life with open hearts and open minds. You gone that ancient till the morning light. Till I crashed in the back of that beat up car parked in the back of some lowly farm. While you and your girl of the week slept under the disappearing stars. Till I awoke to the sound of the radios on the hip of some cars tapping on our windows. Who asked if we were homeless? We said, man, we don't know. So they shoot us away and said, take care now. And we made our way back to my mother's house. And I slept alone, safe for a nasty case of morning math. And then I dreamt of a life I spent on the road with nothing but some shoes and clothes. A liquored up version of what we know. Until I came to in the afternoon, I scratched my head. I said, still anew. To chase that life I dreamt, I'd have to be a fool. Although it's easy to be the big fish in a puddle of a town, I'd like to think I've been learning how to swim. So if I leave here, I don't drown. And all my friends, they've watched me flounder, splash off the face on the Back to my friends that night, I shared my theories thrice revised. I caught a glimmer in the bloodshot eyes, and those two they are hard nuts to crack. But I think that I hit them with a fact how life around here really ain't all bad. No. Well, life around here just really ain't all bad. Yes, if you go looking for a bad time, then it's probably what you like. Cause life around here just really ain't dull Man. Okay <laughs> Thanks so much Now, funny thing about that song and this next song is I wrote that song at about a time in 2012 And uh, this next song was written about the same time But I wrote it like five years later um, Something I remembered that happened a little short. A little short song here. <laughs> A song called Happy Couch from the Posterity Measures album. All right. On the stereo, the Ruben eyes began to flow, and there's no losing to budge at booze. And until the next morning, once you quit your snoring or you wind up dead, just like your friends all saying that you would be, cause it's hard to try to find your place between the never ending beer pong and stumbling thongs. Because all that I've got is just seven bucks and an empty tank in my mother's truck. And so I was pretty stuck, but then I struck some love. Fortunate me, I met somebody while dancing in the living room Just doing my tango with the broom She was sitting pretty and I asked her to join me And we spent the whole evening just a hanging out Enjoyed each other's company until we both heard the familiar sound Flashing red and blue Some cops outside have now been sighted Guess they're mad they weren't invited Thanks be to the negotiators Who feeds them lives over and over Tells them that we're good and sober Sorry sir, we'll rage quieter Till you turn around the corner And we were chilling down on happy couch Cause no one even got arrested Nor breathalyzer tested So we could just keep on shooting that breeze Until our faces start to become sore And maybe after that I'll get your number So tomorrow we'll talk some more Alright <laughs> That's it <laughs> A little short little one here I don't know where that song fits in my set list. Ne I never do. I just I'll open with it, close with it, been in the middle. Here's some new ones here. Um, 
this nice little pin here. I don't know if you get that on the video, but it's a United Nations logo pin. And uh, I went to the United Nations um, last February, right around this time, and it was a heck of a time and put a lot of what I was doing in my life at the time into perspective. And um, looking at all of that way more important work, it made my little work feel important. Um, but this is a song called Lying Awake Dreaming, a song about being tired. <laughs> First time I went to NYC, I didn't take the taxi, silly me. I skipped the subways to that day, just locked across Manhattan, feet of flame. I called up to the homebound bus guard, stuck in traffic for a month. But at least I was sitting still every hour to spend. But I got my fill. Of my breathing, lying away, dreaming. We took the band to Savannah Land, had the George song cook up my tin, gawking up at all the trees. The power lines could not compete. Played the gig and partied forth on the best day of the whole dime tour. But that night I just couldn't sleep, even seven baby hours a day, catching up my breathing, lying on way, dreaming, catching. Buy the ticket, take the ride Hunter used to govern most of my life But I know I'm not as sure That abandonment will mean my cure Cause everybody needs a plan To find peace however they can But mine tends to be a kind That leaves me sleepy, stupid, so blind Catching a my Is that the last song you have for us? Uh, I'll do one more. Awesome. Okay. Instead, the purpose of the pitiful poor was to scare working people and working some more. And there's not a penny to be made by tending to you, but still I cook you down, coach you, stick some with a bill. That class gateway grows slim, the rich keep getting richer. Class gateway grows slim, you can't eat home for dinner. My father worked all day, 40 whole years Now he counts his retirement as his greatest fear Though he should 
the lights off in the place the day you was so When they dark on the boom pop they dropped them into a hole They play gateway grow slim The rich keep getting richer Play gateway grow slim And you can't eat hope for dinner Divide and conquer is the weapon of choice You can't hate your pink hat neighbor for the use of her voice And though day by day I tire of the same old deceit I know we bought it with a vote But hey, let's check that receipt That Kai's gateway grows slim The rich keep getting richer Kai's gateway grows slim And you can't eat home for dinner Kai's gateway grows slim Student debt balloons bigger Kai's gateway grows slim And my patience can't get thin <laughs> a little short rowdy one for you. Uh, I really enjoy your uh, your punk se sensibilities. They, uh, oh, punk, sure. It, it, it's fun. I um I've been called all kinds of things, and it's rock and roll, punk music, folk, country, alt rock. It's all over the yeah. place, and I I cringe at calling it Americana. <laughs> but <laughs> but if that's what ended up being called, I'll, I'll call yeah. it as such. <laughs> yeah, I I just get the feeling like you're very. You have the punk sensibilities that someone, you know, playing folk in the very early stages of, you know, singer-songwriter folk uh, in pop music had, mm -hmm. like, the political sensibilities that make, make it sort of a inspiration for punk music eventually. For sure. Um, there was a band called, um, well, there is a band, I'm not sure what they do, um, called Kind of Like Spitting, you know, Kind of Like Spitting is, um, and they did... I'm, thinking that was the band but they did a whole cover album of a guy uh, guy's music called uh, Phil Oaks mm. look him up it's Phil O-C-H-S he wrote songs like Love Me I'm a Liberal and Draft Dodge Your Rag mm. these were straight up punk rock songs on the mm. acoustic guitar just him and the voice and his albums were always just the acoustic guitar and the voice so not to end this wonderful session I did with you uh, with a comparison of me and <laughs> Phil Oaks <laughs> but he's a big hero of mine awesome uh, anything else you'd like to say to listeners before we move back to our um, regular program? World's not a kind place, so we have to be kind in its place. Be nice to others. Great be thing your to say. best self. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for being here, Brian. Hey, thank you. All right. Thank you. Hey, thanks very much. Thanks very much. Thank you.